in the aftermath of New Hampshire hospital shooting on Friday, law enforcement and state leaders praised Bradley Haas on Saturday for his bravery and dedication to the community after he was shot by John Maddor. He was already a hero when he walked into work yesterday, given his service to our country, to our state, and to the community, New Hampshire Attorney General John Framilla said. Officials from the New Hampshire Department of Health and Human Services said Haas was killed in the line of duty and his actions helped prevent more lives from being lost. We mourn the loss of Bradley Haas, security officer, who was dedicated to New Hampshire's hospital's mission of helping people. The commissioner of NHDHH said, Haas served in the Franklin Police Department for 28 years, first as a patrol officer and eventually as chief of police. He also spent three years as a military police officer in the U.S. Army. Most recently, Haas worked as a security officer for the New Hampshire Department of Safety. The Franklin police chief said Haas was a selfless and beloved member of the community. That's indicative of the kind of man that he was. He gave of himself. From all reports, he was kind, gentle, conservative individual. Chief Davis Goldstein said. Merrimack County Sheriff David Croft said he rose through the ranks of law enforcement alongside Hawes. After hearing the news of his former colleague, Croft said he will remember Haas for always having a positive attitude and smile on his face. Public service was him. He wanted to give back to his community, whether it be in his time as a military police officer in the Army or his 28 years for the city of Franklin. Croft said, his citizens always come first. I can't say anything bad about the man. He was just an incredible individual. Aimed the community's time of mooring, Goldstein said officers will soon wear bands on their badges to honor Haw's legacy. His memory will continue on and we'll never forget him, Goldstein said. Reporting for WRMK News 12, I'm Riley King.